okay so let's go ahead and open up our rifle script and in the rifle script at the top let's create a reference to our animator so we will say public animator let's name this as animator as well then right here if we are firing then what we want to do we want to play some specific animation so we will say animator dot set bool and let's set the fire animation to be true okay and we want the idle animation to be false because we are now firing and after this let's add a else if block and in here we will simply say that if we are firing and we are walking then we want to play some specific animation so for that in the switch camera let's actually copy this line from here and right here let's paste it and it is fire one button and this thing will be the same if you are firing and walking okay if that buttons are pressing at the same time then what we want to do first of all we want the idle to be false we want the idle aim to be true then we want the fire walk to be true okay and guys make sure that you type these names correctly and according to your parameter names okay for example my parameter names are right here okay so i am typing these names right there okay right here so make sure if you are following me then you are just fine but if you use your own names then make sure that you type that names right here as well so after that we will set the walk to true and we will set the reloading to false after this what we want to do we will say that if we are firing and if we are aiming okay so for that we will just copy this and paste it right there let me remove that one round bracket okay so if we are firing and also if we are aiming let's copy that from there okay if that is the case then what we want to do we just simply want the idle to be false the idle aim to be true the fire walk to be true the walk to be true and the reloading to be false okay and after that if we are not firing nor moving and not even aiming then what we want to do we just simply want the fire to be false idle to be true fire walk to be false and reloading to be false as well and talking of reloading let's add the reloading animations as well so right down below right here we leave a comment for ourselves so right here we will say animator dot set bool and let's set the reloading to be true okay when the reload function is called we want to set the reloading animation to be true and when we are done reloading then we will simply set the reloading to be false that's it now if we save this script and get back to unity let's click on our player and inside the player body Tommy the mesh we need to add the animator reference right here so drag and drop the player in it and now if we play the game you will notice that now if we try to fire as you can see it plays the fire animation but it is going back and forth let's finish the bullets i don't know why that is happening let's check it okay it doesn't play the okay it now plays the reloading animation it is now firing and walking and then reloading okay but the firing animation is a little bit messed up let me actually drag and drop the animator right in here so that so now if we try to fire as you can see it is going back and forth between the idle and fire 
so let me just move that up there let's see the changes to normal mode okay if I true then I don't true that's it okay I think there is a problem with our script so guys right here when we are firing and we are moving then what we want to do we want the idle to be false and the firework to be true okay and just remove these other animations because we don't need them okay and after that in here everything else will be the same and from here let's remove the reloading false let's save this okay and then in the animator as you can see this is the animation going to shoot and then this is going back to the idle right here at this as exact time okay from shoot to idle and that is it let's play the game and you will notice that now if we try to shoot as you can see the player is shooting and now he is reloading now he is shooting again reloading and that's it and now if we are walking and try to shoot as you can see is walking and shooting now he reload now let's walk shoot again okay he is now reloading now we can aim and shoot as well and reload as well as you can see so it means that our player is now fully animated and working which is perfectly fine now in the next video we will add the effects okay the muzzle spark and the impact effect so for that catch you guys in the next one